In this video, I am going to show you how to put a diagonal line in Google Sheets. So there's not really a good way currently to do this, but there are a few workaround methods that I'm going to show you today that can kind of do something similar. So the first method I'm going to show is using the draw feature to actually just draw a line inside your spreadsheet. The second method I'm going to show is using tilt format. And the third method is using the sparkline function. So the first method, drawing a line, um, what I'm going to do is come up to the top here, select insert, and then select drawing here. And so after this drawing um, screen is open, what you want to do is select line here, and then draw your line. After your line is created, line color, line weight, line dash options will appear. You're going to want to make sure to increase your line weight. And then after that is done, you can select save and close. And then press enter on your keyboard and your line will appear. So what you have to do is resize this um, to fit the size of a cell. So if I want to cross out uh, maybe this first name with this diagonal line, I'm just going to end up resizing this to fit the cell. Um, so it's not perfect. And that kind of functions as a diagonal line. So you can see this line isn't actually inside the cell. It's just a drawing placed over the cell. Um, you can also use this method to draw an X by doing two diagonal lines, if that's what you want to do. Um, but you can see this this isn't really that great of a method depending on what you're trying to accomplish. It does serve its purpose though. You can get a diagonal line uh, by using this method, but if you're trying to do a bunch of diagonal lines, it's a little bit tedious. Um, so the next method I'm gonna show is just using tilt. Um, so what I'm gonna do in this is I'm gonna have um, two different words that are separated by a diagonal line in this um, header row. So I'm going to select my cell and click um, right after the word end. So at the end of this word here and on my keyboard I'm going to hit Alt and Enter to do a line break. And then on my keyboard I'm going to create these dashed lines here. And then I'm going to press Alt and Enter on my keyboard again. And I'm going to add the second word I want in my header row. And then what I'm going to do is select this cell. And then there is this text rotation option in the toolbar. From here, you can select tilt down or tilt up, depending on which way you want it to tilt. Or there's this degrees here um, if you want some more options. You can also access the same thing through the format menu. So format text rotation, tilt up, tilt down. Um, so that's one way to get a diagonal line inside of your cell. Um, this one has split the cell with this diagonal line and it's a dashed line, so that's an option too. The next method is with the sparkline function. So what sparkline does is it basically creates a miniature chart inside of our spreadsheet. I'm not going to go over this function in too much detail, but with these parameters here, um, 0 and 1, or 1 and 0, and then color, we can create essentially a chart that just has a single diagonal line. So I'll show you what this looks like. Um, you can see it just created a diagonal line. So if you want to change the color of your line, um, you can do that by specifying the color. If you want to change the direction, you just swap the 1 and the 0. And that is another option for inserting a diagonal line in Google Sheets. So those were three workaround methods. There's not really a really good way to do this yet, um, but hopefully one of these methods will serve its purpose for you. If you want to learn more about this, um, be sure to click on the link to the blog post that I'll put in the description of this video um, where I go over this in more detail. 
Thank you for watching the video. If you haven't already, make sure to hit the subscribe button. If you have any questions or content suggestions, just let me know in the comments and I'll try my best to answer everyone.